Every company has its own secrets and its own way to develop. I'm going to share a few secrets of ours. At AJ Protech, when we start new projects, we start with a process called feasibility study. It's a time for us to do solution research, to create product specification, to create early industrial design, select components, and create proof of concept prototypes. The goal here is to select core technologies. Uh, when, when clients come to us with the idea to create a new product, we ask them four questions. What problem are you solving? Who is your customer persona? What are the must-have features for device? And what's the target pricing? After those four questions answered, we get to our job. We start with solution research. So researching what, compo what similar components, similar products are available on the market. See what is patented and what can and cannot be used and we select core technologies which allows us to fulfill the product requirement. Next, next step is create really good product specification. Every company has its own wig, short requirements in most of cases, but it's really important, it's, it's really key here to be really specific. Good product specification covers anywhere from 7 to 15 pages long and it covers not just the must-have features, it covers the operating conditions, storage conditions, mechanical requirements, water protection, electronic features and so on. Also, in the same document, you need to put your pricing on. If you don't know something, that's okay, just put TBD to be determined later. Unknown unknown is the worst that can happen to your product. We see it as the biggest differentiator between products that fail to deliver and those who deliver on time and within budget. Really spend time here to create good product specification document. Now that we know what we are creating, it's time to visualize it. Our industrial designers work on low fidelity sketches, six to ten options to determine what is the possible shape for device. Is it going to be round or rectangular? What are the angles are going to be? So doing six to ten diff different options so we can uh, pick up from them later on.